Most people would say drawing eyes is hard. Well, today I'll try and help you say it's easy with a few tips and tricks I've learned from experience and the internet. So to start off, use references. If you struggle with anything, actually, whether it be hair, clothes, or hands, and you don't have to get real life references, you could just grab some from your favorite artists. That is not stealing as long as it's used only um, as guide guidance for shapes and how something is built. If you repost without permission or trace their heart and, heart and post that, then that'll be considered a stealing. Don't post if it's not yours. And without permission. To clarify, you can do whatever you want in your private gallery. You can trace as much as you want as long as you don't claim someone else's art for your own, whether it be to the internet or your friends and family. Otherwise, you'll find a lot of drama if people find out. And they're gonna find out. Anyways, sorry that took a hot minute. I just wanted to clarify some stuff for the people just starting. Next tip, think in 3D. Now for some of you, this may sound confusing. Let me explain. If you pair this with repetition and some references, you could learn how to draw anything pretty easily. Draw eyes on a head facing slanted to the side a bit, looking up, down, or to the side. Draw how eyes are affected as you move the head in 3D space. If you don't know how this looks, you could always look up a picture on Google, Pinterest, or just take a picture of yourself. Unless you have no eyes, because then I don't know what to tell you. Next up, repetition. If you go up to anyone, there's a 90% chance they'll say, just keep drawing. However, they don't tell you how you should draw and what. That's probably because most people don't even know how they even got good in the first place. All they know is that they drew a lot. You can keep drawing the same thing, maybe even a few changes here and there, but you won't learn that much. Instead, you can draw from a different angle, with a different style, or take something from someone's art who you really like. But the foundation is still the same. This way you can learn more about anything, really, with repetition, references, and thinking in 3D. Finally, here's some tips about drawing eyes specifically. You want to draw two eyelids. You can always erase the lower eyelids if that's not your style. You just want to draw two so you know where the eye starts and ends. Also, if you're struggling with eyelashes, think of them as 3D lines that curve outward. So if you're drawing an eye facing forward, then the middle lashes would be facing straight. As you go more to the side, you'll see that lashes curve more. You can play with this element as much as you want, making eyelashes thicker, shorter, or triangle-shaped. Lastly, eyebrows. Though, although technically not part of the eye, help convey emotions in your drawings. Whether it be sadness, fear, anger, or happiness. Besides, people without eyebrows are scary. Well... That's all I have for you guys. If you've done all the following for a while and still haven't seen progress, then I recommend you do more research. Learn smarter, not harder. Also, if you want to see my full process, then check out my channel. I have numerous speed paints just gaining dust in my channel. Just go give them a view or something.